hello from Edinburgh again. I'm Megat Land Sports Pavilion, and it's uh, actually Burnmuir Rugby Club's ground. But I'm here for Tin Castle FC versus Socky. Oh, he's fat, oh, crazy. He's fat, oh, man. And a fat boy has robbed him all the wee bits and see. Well, that's, that's me just in the ground. Um, yeah, Tin Castle FC are playing Socky, and. Uh, Socky are actually second equal in the league, they're uh, on goal difference, or third in goal difference and uh, Tink Castle FC are in 12th place So I'm just walking down the, the ramp as you come in and uh, yeah we'll get a wee look at the ground and there's a lot of ground toppers here, there's uh, ground toppers up from England and Wales believe it or not <laughs> it's ground hopping weekend and I'll maybe say a bit more about that later I'll be a chance to get some interviews with people as well I'm just going to be walking the ground. They've actually got a wee bit of terracing over there, and they've got this bit up here, which is a sort of seating area up here, and uh, it's a bit like a terracing behind the goal as well. Um, yeah, it's good. See up there, <laughs> putting me a rugby club home and away. <laughs> um, so this is like their, so I mean, pavilion and all the rest of it, but it's not used. It's not used by the football team. Um, but yeah, that's a stand. There's a good stand. Good facilities. So I'm just going to have a wee walk around to the terrace in there. Um, yeah, this is the terrace and it's quite good. Quite good by terrace and height up here. It's quite good. Good view. Although it's not uh, Tank Castle's ground, well, they play here obviously, it's Burnmuir Rugby Clubs. It is one of the better grounds, I think, in the East of Scotland League. Yeah, I always like to walk around the ground if I can. And uh, it's all part of a bigger sports complex because there's more, there's another sort of stand over there. I think there's hockey played here. As you see, there, it's like one of these double stands. And uh, there's another complex over there. It's all part of Edinburgh Ledger, I believe, as well. So it's quite a good uh, sports complex. Anyway, I bumped into Rab from the Socky Committee. Hey, what were you saying? You brought up uh, some merchandise with the ground toppers. For, uh, eh? If the people want to oh, buy them and that, the right. scarves, uh, key rings, badges. Oh, good. I'll, I'll mention it to the guys then. Because, on, yeah. Some programs and that. Good. Sort of Excellent stuff. Right, so you're looking forward to the game then, eh? Second place equal, eh? So That's right. I mean, That's right. We had a good result on Tuesday night there against uh, Crossgates and, uh, right. and a cup tie. Fancy meeting you here, Sam, and Graham, of course, great catching yep. you again. We meet again. It's an it's a important weekend to the ground toppers. Have you been speaking to quite a few of them already, the ground top weekend? There's loads of them here. I know, eh? It's a, a yeah. bus load. A yeah, yeah, load yeah. I know, it's amazing, isn't it? It's yeah, amazing, yeah. eh? Fair play and of course, to And of course, we, we're here as well, of course. Yep. I'm just here, not with the ground topping guys, but I knew that no, today was no. happening and... I think there'd be a good atmosphere because of it, good turnout and stuff. Yeah. Are you going to the, the games on Saturday as well? Or are you going to try and do them? I actually haven't decided what I'm doing no. tomorrow yet. Right, so right. Potentially, but Aye. possibly not. I'm not sure. I need well, I'm worried about my battery, so I'll, I'll need to keep because I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm going to try and do yeah. I know, I know. I think I'll, I'll struggle. But anyway, so you'll be doing a match day vlog again for yep, us. Yep, eh? here today, good, yeah. well, we'll look out for it, Sam, as Perfect. always. Thank you very much, mate. See you later. Some All right. Ties. Oh, there's a scarf there. At least they're more than white in those programs. Good evening, everybody. Merry Christmas. Make it on Stadium, the whole hub for tonight's game in the Eastern Scotland Premier League between Tank Castle and Sockey. Sockey! Well, there's Tyne Castle, of course, playing in the Monroe and uh, Sockey are in blue tonight. Oh, oh there's an earth and there we go. Oh. Seen some bad. Oh, is it enough? Oh, that's the spoiler. Eh? Yeah? Oh my god, what is it? 
Summed off to explain what's happening. It's not off. I don't know. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. well, the guy's been self, but nobody's really sure exactly. Well, he must have said something. But... Crazy, isn't it? Crazy. Still arguing, still arguing, you know, going off eh? Oh well, there you go, that's amazing, eh? Uh, that must only be about two minutes or something. I'm looking for a chance to even up, won't it? Yeah, yeah. Set off now because it was, it was a bad tackle, they deserved the book in, but no way of sending off. But everybody's saying because the referee made a hold up of the first one, he's evened up. Oh, it's a good door! Oh, the bar. That was a good shot. Oh, reflection. <laughs> Could have been the corner. 
Well, that's half time. Yeah, hey, what's your name? Just uh, Aled Roberts. And where have you come from today? Uh, from Wrexham. Wrexham, doing wheels, aye. Yeah. Well, did you come up by the bus then? No, came by up by car. They come up by car, aye. Right? Because I know, I know one of the buses was picking up wheels as well. You're, are you up for the weekend as well then? Yeah. Yeah, up for today, tomorrow, and Sunday. back down on Sunday. Yeah. All right, all right. Like uh, early on Sunday, we're right. only coming for the games today and uh, and the four on Saturday. The four on Saturday. Yeah, be good. Yeah. Oh, 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 good save. Bye. Oh, the go, oh, oh, oh. Oh, there we go, another one. Oh, <laughs> oh, there we go. There we go. That was a mistake by the defender, eh? Oh, there's a chance here for. Oh. Both teams had a lot of chances. As you said, they are obviously you want to talk about the match and other things. Both obviously went in level at half time. I thought that Socky looked a lot fitter and stronger in the second, second half. half. Yeah. But then Tiny and Aweir anyway, managed to get themselves back into the game. They did. And made an interesting end to the game. So yeah. I and obviously. 
referees probably. <laughs> One of the worst referee performances you've ever no, seen no, in my Incredible, life. eh? He was, right. he was mental. <laughs> All right, well, five goals, though. I mean, it was a good game, but Aye, uh, it, was game it, was, it, was, it was ruined by the decisions. Uh, oh, no, no doubt about it. Hey, right, thanks, Graham. Well, there's the coach, all the ground toppers came on. Amazing, eh? And there was a lot who came independently in their own cars as well. Amazing. There was 448 there, a crowd, I reckon, about 300 more than you would normally get at one of these games. Incredible. Well, it was great meeting up with all the guys again, Sam and uh, Graham. There was a few others that were there, uh, the ground toppers that are normally there, um, but I didn't see them. I think they were avoiding me. Oh, no, but we'll see them over the weekend as well. Um, listen, that was an amazing crowd. 448 that were there, and there was a big coach up from England and Wales because I know they picked up, I was watching to follow them on Twitter, uh, they were uh, picking up wheels in London and other places, and there was an awful lot of uh, come up independently as well uh, for the ground topping weekend. An amazing crowd. Uh, there was a few sucky fans here as well, of course. And what a game, I mean, the decisions, I mean, I kept it running, I, I really don't know what happened there, I must have said something. But incredible, getting sent off in the first couple of minutes. And as you probably heard in the commentary, there's a guy in front of me and also Graham next to me were saying the ref's going to have to even this out, out and right enough, a tackle. I mean, it, okay, it was a foul. Was it a booking? Maybe it was a booking, but the guy got sent off. Absolutely incredible. So the game was ruined by some odd decisions by the referee. Anyway, thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe and I hope you enjoyed my wee video of the game. <laughs>